Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another blog tech tips. And of course guys, today I have the iPhone and this will apply to any iPhone and the issue I'll be showing you how to fix on this particular occasion involves the iPhone mobile data keeps consuming my credit or minutes or data. So guys, if you're having that particular issue where your data is being um, consumed or minutes or credit or whatever it is without you actually doing anything this um tutorial is just going to show you what you can do to fix it all right this applies to any carrier globally all right so straight away on your iphone um just go ahead and unlock your device now of course while your device is unlocked as mine is unlocked now one of the first things i wanted to check or do is to simply go ahead and of course check your data balance now depending on where you are um, after checking your data balance you might find that it's lower or if it's um a cash based system the amount of um, credit you have on your device is lower than normal now um, on some devices what you got to do in these cases is simply go ahead what you got to do is just simply go ahead and you're going to place your device into airplane mode now what this does is that because um, if your device calls on your carrier to actually provide data they might hold a part of your credit or hold a section of your data or so on against your account it doesn't mean that it's necessarily used, but of course, once they hold on to that, sometimes you have to just nudge the system to refresh and of course give you back your data. So one thing you can actually try, it will not work on all networks, is simply just go ahead. You're going to bring down control center as seen right here on your iPhone. And next, you're going to place your device in airplane mode. And you're going to just wait 10 seconds or you can just count to 10. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. All right, so once you do that, what it does is turn off all radios on your device. So simply then tap it again. And then of course your device will connect freshly with your carrier. In some cases, this is able to refresh the system. And of course you can check your data balance. And in some cases, the data will be returned. Or of course the credit. In other cases, of course, it might not work. So what you'll have to do in those cases is try it again. I advise that you at least try this three times before giving up on this particular method. Next, of course, you can turn off um, your data or mobile data or disable LTE. Of course, the LTE networks work differently across devices. And of course, these settings are network based, meaning you will not see the exact settings um, or the same settings as me. So simply go into um, settings. Once you're in settings, guys, you want to go over to your um, mobile data. And once you're in your mobile data right in here, you're just going to check out to make sure that of course on your device it might not say mobile data option it might say on some carriers um, it will say something like um, settings then you go to cellular data or of course settings then mobile data and once you're under mobile data you should see an option somewhere around here you might have to look for it that says enable or disable LTE so if you do get the option on your carrier it should appear on the this section here, as I said, that says cellular data or mobile data. And of course, um, on some carriers as well, it may not show up. So if you're on LTE, simply disable the LTE mode. Later on, when you're ready to browse again, simply come back in here and re-enable the LTE mode. So do not worry about disabling it. Again, settings might vary, but of course, as you can see here, I'm in settings mobile data. So in case you missed that, I'm on the settings. Um, mobile data right here I've tapped and of course in this case what I'm going to show you to do is disable the settings related to your internet so for example as you see here I have mobile data network I'm going to select that and mobile data network will show me all the basic information to connect to my carrier's mobile um, network and of course in here it does basically come in and what you want to do is to delete all of these um, values or in other words you can enter a wrong value in this way what you have doing what you have done is to disable the internet at a settings level. I find that this might work as well. So what you can do here is either erase what's here or if you want the easier method, simply add something here. So for example, notice where it says the APN here. You can try adding like an extra letter, like an X. So I could put basically place like an X right here or maybe on all of these I can add an extra X. That way the settings will be wrong and then in the background, your device cannot call on your data network or in other words um, 
it will not use your data as the internet or mobile base settings is incorrect all right when you want to use the internet again simply come back in and of course um, remove the extra character that you added and of course once you're finished you can always go back next thing guys and of course we're still on the settings mobile data notice mobile data is off you can always disable your mobile data although in some cases even if mobile data is off it will still connect so that's an extra tip simply keep the settings off as well and you can actually use control center here you'll see the mobile data option right there simply tap to turn on and tap again to turn off and it's always recommended you can turn it off in settings by disabling the feature right there another thing to, is to figure out which app is calling on your mobile data in the background so a clue is to go again here in settings as seen here let me show you to get back here is the same settings so go back over to mobile data and on the mobile data right here you'll notice it shows what's consuming mobile data um, of course again you can look through and see what's consuming your data if you can figure out the app you can either a uninstall the app that's calling on the um, your data in the background or b you can go ahead and if you find out which app is consuming um, data in the background you can go into its personal settings if it's an app you cannot um, disable and disable the um, the ability of that app to work in the background that way it will not run in the background and cause your data to be consumed all right guys so that has been a bunch of quick tips showing you how you can fix the issue on your iphone and in extension, some of these tips will work on our device as well. Um, how to prevent um, your mobile data from being consuming or your credit from being used up whenever you're not using it on your device. So as you said, it's usually a background process or something like that or a rogue setting. You can also call your carrier and relate the issue to them. Maybe they can fix it from their side as it might be a carrier issue as well. All right, guys, we got a gardener from Logtech Tips. Bye until next time. Bye.